Hi guys, it's Dr. T here, also known as Dr. Pelvic Floor. Welcome back to another video. The goal of my channel is to discover, listen to, and promote stories from overlooked voices, including my own, and not to mention a little education as well. All right, guys, let's go. Hi guys, it's Dr. T, it's Dr. Tanaka Dune, and I'm back. So I've been away for a little bit. It's been a little bit of a hiatus, but every now and then you need a break. And it's not that I was doing nothing. I mean, I have my regular job and I'm doing some things for research and planning a few upcoming things, but I've missed you guys. And I wanted to just make sure that I posted a video and then kind of get back in the swing of YouTube life. All right, so I just wanted to let you know that I was part of the most awesome campaign recently. It's called Share the Mic. And it's also based on Share the Medical Mic. Now, let me tell you what the basis of this is. There are two fabulous doctors that organize this. Their Instagram handles will be linked below. But I just wanted to make an amazing shout out to Dr. Renee Paro and also to Dr. Lauren Powell. So these physicians were the organizers of this Share the Mic campaign. And so this is the premise of the whole campaign. So this campaign took place on July 22nd, 2020. I hope this is something that we can do on a yearly basis. I mean, I think it's the coolest thing. Their vision was to do an Instagram takeover day. And with that Instagram takeover day, what would happen is that black women physicians would be linked to other women physicians that were not black with the whole purpose of amplifying black physician female doctors. I was actually invited to this campaign by Dr. Tayaba Ahmed. Dr. Ahmed is a PM&R physician in New York City and I actually met her in New York City. So it was awesome. It was incredible that she actually thought of me to ask to see if I could join the campaign. We ended up getting paired up and I was gonna take over her Instagram account. Now, many of you may know that I'm actually in Melbourne, Australia and Tayaba is all the way in New York City, but with the support of her and the support of the entire campaign, we were able to finish the campaign and post successfully. And I was able to take over her Instagram account for the day. So now that the campaign is finished and I can reflect upon the campaign, I just want to guide you to go over to my Instagram, Dr. Tanaka Doom. You can also go to Dr. Pallet Floor. There'll be in information there. And you can also go onto Dr. Taya Med's Instagram because that's the Instagram that I took over. And you can actually see what this campaign was about. And I'm going to embed in this video some things about this campaign and some pictures and also some of the media coverage that we ended up getting. Guys, this is so cool that we as individuals, that we as people, that we as women can come together supporting physicians, supporting black female physicians in order to amplify our voices and to get their voices out there and to give our chance to be on a platform that we might otherwise not have been able to be. I mean, I'm so lucky because Dr. Tai Ahmed has like 11,000 followers, but I was able to gain a few followers and certainly that was not the purpose of it, but it seemed that with this gain of new followers that with the with what I'm trying to do and what I'm trying to get out there, there are people that might be interested in the story I have to share with the rest of the world. And I just feel like that is the coolest thing. So again, a huge shout out to Dr. Renee Paro and to Dr. Lauren Powell for starting this and a huge shout out to the 80 women that participated. On the next screen, I'm just gonna put a screenshot of these 80 women. So then guess what ended up happening? We ended up being featured on the Today Show and also in Pop Sugar. This is cool. Mama, I made it. I mean, I saw my clip picture quickly roll by on the Today Show. And welcome back. There's a new campaign launching on Instagram today. It's called hashtag share the medical mic. It's all about amplifying the voices of black women physicians. 40 of them are participating, hoping to bring more awareness to the healthcare obstacles black women face as patients. And we're joined by two of them this morning. We have board certified OBGYN and I surgeon go, Dr. Jessica Shepard from Dallas, Texas. So that means that this campaign was projected to women in North America. The other cool thing was the feature in Pop Sugar. And do you know what Pop Sugar did? Pop Sugar took the pairings of us 80 women and specifically listed them in their story. That is awesome. And there's, it, there's something about seeing your name amplified and made important or at least recognized that, you know, everyone, ne everyone needs once in a while. And 
I, I couldn't be more happy as to how this entire campaign went. And I feel like right now I'm the luckiest person in the world. So what did I do specifically for the campaigns? I created a video and then broke it up into five parts because Instagram only allows you to post 60 second videos at a time. The videos have to range anywhere from three seconds to 60 seconds. So I had to split up the video into five parts. And what Tayaba Ahmed did for me was because I'm all the way in Australia and so I was asleep as the campaign was going on, she would post one video every couple of hours with the caption that I had preset. No questions asked, she did it. She didn't know the content of what I was gonna say. She didn't know how I was going to influence her audience and she just did it. And I was able to get my ideas and my thought process across. So that said, what I'm gonna do next is post that five minute video for you guys. And I hope you enjoy it. Hi guys. This is Dr. Tanaka Dune on my Instagram. I'm known as Dr. Tanaka Dune and I'm also known as Dr. Pelvic Floor. And I also have a YouTube channel. I'm just so excited to take over Dr. Ahmed's Instagram today. And what I want to talk about most likely comes in three parts, especially because these Instagram videos are relatively short. The very first thing I just wanted to get across is that I'm so excited that Dr. Ahmed has graciously allowed me to take over her Instagram so I can reach a different audience. And just this whole Share the Medical Mic campaign is so important to us as Black women, especially because then we can get access to a whole bunch of different people that we otherwise wouldn't get access to. And the fact that we have allies and non-Black women supporting us and getting our voices out there is incredibly huge. I'm so grateful to this. I'm so grateful for the campaign. Definitely, let's all share the medical mic. Let's share the mic. So one of the things that I wanted to get across is being as authentic as you can in the situation that you're in. <laughs> Many of you may not realize that I'm actually sitting in Melbourne, Australia right now. Um, I was in New York and I had a fantastic job in New York City and then ultimately moved to Melbourne, Australia and I've been able to find a fantastic job here working as a subspecialist urogynecologist. I'm incredibly lucky to be able to do this, but this is hard. Moving countries is hard and changing your geographic setting and also the cultural setting can be hard. Now, I'm not saying that everyone moves countries or that everyone has to change their ge geographic location, but I just want us to all recognize for a bit that we as women and we as women of color and we as women of color in North America really take time to be as authentic with ourselves and truthful to ourselves. When I was actually working on this campaign and talking about this campaign with Dr. Ahmed, I literally poured my heart out and I said, listen, uh, I want to do this campaign. This is amazing. I want to get my voice out, but there's a lot of things that are on my plate right now. And I'm getting better at being much more honest about those things and being my true authentic self. Because if you take a look at my YouTube or if you take a look at my Instagram or, or if you take a look at my LinkedIn, you're going to think, this person has zero problems. She can move from Canada to the United States and then now Australia without a hitch. It's hard. It's hard. And I want to just let you know that I sitting here, I'm proud of myself. I'm sitting here proud of you guys watching. I'm sitting here proud of most people for just that daily grind and that daily ability to get through. And sometimes that is the best that you can do. And I was, you know, I was really thinking as to what I would say or what videos I would create here um, as I take over uh, Dr. Ahmed's Instagram. And to me, at the end of the day, I just felt like, listen, I have to be as authentic to myself and as authentic to you as possible. I have fantastic opportunity that I've achieved in my life. I've achieved fantastic level of education and I have achieved a fantastic level of opportunities. I mean, it's, it's sometimes insane and it blows me away. Even opportunities like this to speak to you guys and to take over someone else's Instagram account, it just blows me away, it's amazing. But at the end of the day, we are still humans. We are still women. We are still people of color. 
we're still black women and there's so many other pressures that kind of sit right on your shoulders as you're trying to sift and make sure that you realize that fundamental duty you have to yourself to move forward with purpose and or move forward with design in order to be as authentic to yourself as possible. Now, it's a hard thing to explain what I'm trying to say, but for that one person who may be listening to this, keep on trucking. All right, guys, it's been fantastic being on Dr. Ahmed's Instagram today. And I just wanted to say thank you so much. Check out Dr. Tanaka Dune, that's me, Dr. T. Also check out Dr. Pelvic Floor, check out my YouTube channel, and you know, leave a comment. Leave a comment on Dr. Ahmed's Insta, leave a comment on my Insta, leave a comment on YouTube, and just let me know if you understand what I'm trying to say and trying to get across that. Ultimately, being truthful and mindful as to where you are at the moment is great power in and of itself. All right, guys, see you later. I'm so very proud of what we were able to achieve. Well, that's it, guys. I hope you liked the video. I hope you liked the video that I posted for the campaign. And again, I just can't reiterate how cool this was. All right, guys, if you like these videos, definitely subscribe. I'm almost there, almost at 200 followers. So I just wanted to thank you so much to all my supporters out there. I wanted to say a big shout out again to Dr. Renee Paro and to Dr. Lauren Powell and definitely, of course, to Dr. Tayaba Ahmed in New York City. Thank you so much for being my partner on the Share the Mic campaign and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.